Hello everyone, this is Derice. I am here with my finished collage for the Marguerite Miller Weekly Collage Challenge. Now, if you haven't heard about this challenge, it's been going on the entire year. Marguerite Miller um, has a list of props that she has for each week, and we come up with our own collage based on those props. And I will have her information below the video in case you're interested in uh, getting more information or uh, would like to find out uh, other things that she offers. Okay, so let's look at the props for this week. We have something fast, a scrap from a paper pad, a flag, architecture, text other than English or your native language, and the bonus item is tissue paper. Okay, so that first prompt, something fast, I have this cool car here from the 1960s. It came from like a, a ladies home companion magazine, something like that. Next is a scrap from a paper pad. I kind of took that a step further and instead of using one, I just used several different scraps I had and just made a collage on each page. Then we have a flag. I'm gonna combine the next two props here, a flag and architecture. I'm using for both of them this beautiful linen postcard. It's an image of the Betsy Ross house in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Our family actually went there a couple years ago. We were touring in that area and happened to see it. So I have the flag and the next prompt was architecture and we're using her house for my architecture prompt. Then text other than English or your native language. I have a little piece here from a, it's an embroidery pattern, embroidery instructions. I've used it another time or two in other collages and it just happens to work because the one side of the directions is all in another language, so that's perfect. And then that last item, the bonus item is tissue paper. I decided to use sewing tissue since I have a ton of it. And I have just put it around in various spots here, up in here, you know, then again up here. I uh, actually used some Mod Podge to first lay a layer of that down. And then I put the tissue down and did a layer of Mod Podge over the top. And that way it would seal it in and wouldn't rip off the page when I go to use the book and I also put a piece over here and where I created a pocket for my prompt card. And I will, I, I always uh, journal each week on my collage somewhere or on this, uh, usually this page. So um, I didn't really think about that at first, but there are several spots where I can write. Just use a darker marker or pen. And I can also just uh, set a piece of uh, paper inside my cute little pocket here. Okay, well that is my collage for week 34. I hope you'll check out that hashtag 2023CWP34 where you can see other crafters taking the same prompts and creating unique collages of their own. I appreciate all of you stopping by. I hope you're all having a great day and we'll see you next time.